hi guys and welcome back to the channel as you can see my eyes are already prepped and ready to go we're gonna go in with the festival palette by juvia's place and we're gonna start off with this beautiful pink color called eerie g and focus that in the inner corner of the eye above the crease blending it out then we're gonna go in with the color ofala it's a beautiful orange red color and we're gonna focus that on the outer corner above the crease area and we're just going to go ahead and buff that out as well. Now going in with the Morphe 35 Boss Mood Palette using the colors Stroke of Luck and Express Yourself. I mixed the two colors and now I'm applying it in the outer corner only and buffing that out as well. Next, I'm going to take the Tarte Shape Tape and applying that on my lid to cut my crease. I'm looking up to mark where I am going to start my line and just patting that on and winging it out. Take your time doing this process so that way you can get a nice clean line. Now I'm just swinging it out, cutting the crease. Next I'm going to go in with the Urban Decay Spectrum Palette using this beautiful color in purple called Flashback and applying that all over the lid space only. I'm also going to wing it out. As you can see, I left a middle space where I cut my crease and that was intentional guys. Now we're using the Stila Triple Threat Collection Glitter and Glow Liquid Eyeshadow Set in the color Smoldering Satin. I'm placing that in the area where we had left it blank and I'm just tracing that line with this beautiful glitter. So I wanted to use more colors, so I went in with the Juvia's Place Zulu palette. These don't have any names, guys. So as you can see, I used this color, this pinkish red color, along with an orange color. And I just mixed the two and buffed them underneath the eye area. Then I went in with the Huda Beauty Electric Obsessions palette because again I wanted to use even more color <laughs> and I used this beautiful dark bluish color to also apply in the inner corner at the bottom of the lash line. Then I went in with the Wet n Wild Mega Liner in Voltage Blue and created a cat eye wing then I went back in with the Morphe palette using the color pop star for the inner corner highlight then once I was good with that I cleaned off my face with a wipey just you know for any excess that was all over my face and I wanted to do my face off camera so I'll be right back and here is the final look you guys what do you think? Leave me a comment down below, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I will see you guys soon.